What's up guys, welcome back to The Coin Expert. Um, I apologize for my lack of uploading recently. Uh, school's been starting back up, it's been really hard to upload. Um, so, but yeah, I have part three of my father's collection coming soon sometime. Um, I'm gonna try to be coming out with a what is it and how much is it worth, but today, I'm very excited for this video I'm doing today. I'm gonna be talking about a bill that could possibly be worth over $150,000 that is hiding in your wallet, one of your wallets, possibly many of your wallets today. So the funny thing about these bills is one of the bills is worth $1, but if you match it up with the second bill, then it can be worth from $20,000 to $150,000 or even more, depending on condition and serial number. So basically um, what it is is with the 2013 series of star no or bills, they had star notes, they needed star notes, uh, the government needed star notes, so they sent a request to their DC branch to make 6.4 million star notes, which is a simple request, happens all the time, nothing very big um, or out of the ordinary about it. But the problem is a little bit later, due to just like miscommunication or something, that same request got sent to their Fort Worth facility, and so two pairs of the same star notes got printed. So then the Mint realized, oh my goodness, we just counterfeited 6.4 million star or notes or dollar bills or whatever these are only on the one dollar bill by the way we just counterfeited 6.4 million dollar bills um so they weren't really public about it until this man was browsing um and kind of had a sharp eye and found out that this uh they had counterfeited 6.4 million dollars and they uh asked the government and they admitted to uh pretty much counterfeiting 6.4 million dollars um in one dollar bills so the, obviously there's uh, 6.4 million pairs, 12.8 million dollar bills um, of, there's one of each, or there's two, sorry, there's two of each. So the, uh, the problem is there's 12.8 million dollar bills that are duplicates, or, or are part of a pair, but there's 11.7 billion dollar bills in circulation today. So you guys can do the math and find out that that is a very tiny percentage of the total of dollar bills and what is out in circulation today. So the dollar bills, the series and stuff, it's a very specific series. It's 2013 B, which means New York. So on the uh, the seal on the left-hand side of the note, it's gonna be a giant B um, instead of any of the other letters. It is a star note. So um, 2013 star note, uh, New York, and the different star notes that there are, there's a lot of different star notes, but the ones specifically that are duplicated um, is B1 through B250,000, and then from B32,001 to B96,000. So yeah, there's a lot of star notes out there. This is just a tiny little fraction of the um, star notes that are out there. But you are not going to be able to... So if you find one of these, which I do not have one of these, um, this video is kind of trying to make... Uh, one of Silver Picker's, actually Silver Picker's most recent video. If you guys have not heard of Silver Picker, go check him out. Link in the description. He made a video about this. Uh, he wanted his video to go viral because, not for him, but because um, he wanted people to be able to find the matches and he wanted the project to be able to find the matches. So that's where this uh, project comes into play. The Zeggers and Winograd project. Um, they have created a spreadsheet of sorts showing all the different star notes that they've gotten, but only sadly... Only about 11,000 uh, bills have been submitted to that list. Silver Picker created a uh, submission form, if you will, also link in the description, so you guys can enter your star notes and possibly find the match, or it's um, going to be put into the list so that when your match is found, then they can facilitate a buy-sell trade between the two people. Only nine matches have been found so far because only 11,000 bills have been put in there out of... 12.8 million bills. So again, very small fraction have been put in of the very small fraction of bills in the war or the one dollar bills in the United States. So you guys really need to go look through all of your change, every single dollar bill that goes through. Look through your mom's change, look through your kids' change, everything. Look through your dad's change, your grandparents' change, anything. Any of those dollar bills that you guys find, put them in the submission sheet. Link in the description, like I said. So yeah, I really thank Silver Picker for uh, putting out a video like this. This is going to be a great video. I really want this video. I'm really uh, hyped up about this project, and I did not know about it until he put his video out, but I actually really want this uh, 
project to be great, to be big. But the problem is these bills were printed from 2014 to 2016, the 2013 series. Um, but the average uh, bill lifespan is only 5.8 years. Um, again, I am going from... This is basically the outline of Silver Picker's video. You guys can go watch his video, link in the description. But yeah, it's only 5.8 years. The time for this uh, project is running out. There's not much time left. But the last thing I need to ask you guys um, is to make this video viral as well as making Silver Picker's video viral. If you only want to make his video viral, great, better his than mine. Um, he's got 80,000 or 84,000, I think, subscribers. That'd be great if you guys could. He's already got over 2,000 views. This video is probably going to get about 50 views uh, at most, but make these videos viral. And if you guys want to do a video uh, recapping what he said, again, go off of what he said. Um, I'm already doing the recap, so don't recap what I said because it'll be end up being a short video. People won't get all the information. So I just gave you guys the very, very basic information. He has a video a little bit longer on it. So make sure to uh, comment on this video, like this video, um, share this video and Silver Pickers video to your social media, to any uh, news outlets or anything that other people will see because even your non-numismatic friends will probably be interested in finding a bill that could be worth $20,000 or a set of bills, I'm sorry, that could be worth $20,000 to $150,000. Um, and even with like the some of the rare... Um, the rarer numbers, if you will, like three, 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 three. I don't know if that's part of the series, but it's, uh, it's probably not. But say that that's probably going to fetch a little bit higher value if you have two sets of or if a set of bills that say three, 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 three star. So thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, again, please make these videos go crazy. Share these videos everywhere. Like the video. Um, tell your friends about it, even make another video because you guys probably have followers that uh, I don't have and that Silver Picker doesn't have. Surprisingly, I've, seen, uh, I've met a few people that have not heard of him. So thank you guys for watching, and as always, good luck and happy collecting.